Hello there, and welcome back to After Hours Content with me, Nick. We play a video game, we have a little fun, and we analyze it to try to learn something. And we're back on Dathomir, which is basically the place of death and destruction and bad, bad juju. Uh, we're going to the temple, and we're going to see what awaits us. Someone's here. Hi, boyos. Oh, whoa, that didn't go according to plan. Just for once, I wanted to do that. I've never been able to do that move. Alright. I guess I have to look at you for this to count. This is very dangerous. I would never actually do this. Alright, cool. He's done with. I'll focus on you, sir. Oh, that was... That was very careless of me. I didn't use more force powers. Could have easily overwhelmed him. But that was fun nonetheless. I'm just trying to get back into the groove of it all. Also still checking for goody goodies. I don't know why I said that really weirdly. Um, Alright, so we got some stuff up there. I don't know if I can get up there. Maybe? Alright, well. We're going to go over here first. Oh, I keep forgetting I have the climbing gloves and they're so awesome. Alright, we got any stuffs? Now let's go single, huh, Cal? Aha, we have a thing. We shouldn't be here. This place is cursed. Don't be scared. Uh, Don't yes. Terran Malikos. Your magics. It's kind of interesting how, um, so, like, the Night Sisters, right? They're kind of, like, um, I don't know how best to describe them. Like, they're not Force users. Fallen sisters. At least not like the Jedi. This man has promised to grant us our vengeance, but only if I teach him our magic. I, it, Cal. Forgive me. I must ally with Malikos. But yeah, like, uh, the Night Sisters, they sort of have, like, a little bit more, um, I think there's... So, if you look at, like, traditional folklore and whatnot, you have, like, wizards who are, like, you know, trained in arcane arts, and they, like, derive stuff from, like, understanding how, like, the elements work and all that. I think the sisters are sort of a little bit, like, if Jedis are monks, then, like, the best way I th can think of sisters, they're kind of like, uh, witches and that the more of them that there are, the more power they can channel, and they sort of do it more um, ritualistically, so to speak. Oh, who dat? You chose to return. Brave. But not wise. Maybe. Marin, right? I'm Cal Kestis. What you were told about the Jedi was not true. So you say. Cal. Malikos said many things, too. Terra Malikos might have been part of my order, but what he is now, I... I have no idea. Oh, it's interesting. I don't think mean, Cal technically knows All about the Sith. Having a lightsaber isn't what makes you a Jedi. Then what does? We were peacekeepers. We were betrayed by those we protected. Hunted down by the Empire. I... I might be one of the last of my kind. I was only a child when they attacked. An armored warrior brandishing this descended upon us. 
I think that was my technically Dooku, if I remember right. My sisters. Until I was left alone. With the dead. Then Malikos came. And promised me revenge. If I shared our secrets with him in return. Mm -hmm. Ooh, indeed. I know what it's like to lose everything. And Malikos was wrong to use that against you. We don't have to be enemies. We will need this. There she goes again. So one... I'll be watching. Oh, I'm... Let's get out of here. So one thing that I also really enjoy about this is how... Malikos lies ahead. You could turn back. Where are you? I can't. Lives are at stake. Whose lives? Innocence. Poor sensitive children who will be hunted down and murdered. As we were. So one thing that I think works really well. Oh, what happened here? Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, thank you. Send it back. I don't want it. My friend. I have never been one to shy away from the pursuit of knowledge. Uh, I'm just kind of a ruthless leader who destroyed the Ashiums and lives of any who oppose the sage's rule. Ugh. Yeesh. Uh, but yes, one thing that I think makes this game work so well, and again, you do not necessarily need to have a great, interesting story for a great game. Like, um, like I've, I've said before that, um, you know, there are some parts of this game that where the story beats are a little odd, but... Something terrible happened here. Um. Uh, a massacre. They killed their own kind. Many things are done very, very power. well. And of particular are the characters. Uh, Marin is actually very similar to Cal in terms of what she went through. Sarah has her own difficulties, but, uh, um, uh, what's her face? Marin... Uh, is a little bit more similar to what she experienced with Cal, which makes it a little bit easier for them to connect and, um, you know, uh, understand each other a little bit more. And also, what's about to happen over here? Ugh. Calcestis. Malikos. Welcome home. It's beginning home. Your training. What in these ruins tempts you so much to risk death? I could ask you the same thing. There is power there. Beyond Jedi understanding. Power I control. I would offer you the same thing. Don't you understand? I'm not interested in power. I want to restore the Order. Restore the Jedi Order? Oh, you poor fool. It's over! Jedi fell long before the Purge. The other thing that's also interesting, narratively, is... Deafened by our past glories. Malikos is something that Blinded Cal could have turned war. into, because he also was betrayed by but the it's troops. it's never over, Malikos. We stand here now, the chance to learn, to rebuild from our mistakes. Jedi learn. There's no future for them. Why can you not see that? It's time for something new. You and me. We could build something different. Something better. No. Dathomir will be your grave. See now, why you gotta go and make it violent all of a sudden? Oh, you jerk. Come on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That timing always messes me up because he, he doesn't strike right away. Try that again. 
he also does that stupid faint. Oh, I let go. That was my fault. Alright, come here. Alright, yeah, yeah. No, oh, don't you flourish at me. I need help, bud. Dodging won't save you. I got him down halfway already? Alright, not doing too bad. No, you didn't. No, no. no, 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 no. A little help, Marin. Marin. Thank you, Marin. You have no right to talk the mirror. No right to our magic. Get up, Calcestis. You're not dead yet. All right, this is where it gets tricky. Oh, what? Oh, you cheap. Oh, no. Ah, you. Oh, circle, circle. No, 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 no. Ha ha. I hate it when you do that. Ah, you jerk. You. Oh, I'm going to kick your butt so bad. Oh, he's asking for it. This. So one thing that I was trying to say before, before he was going all power hungry. One, uh, it's very interesting because the Sith are temperamental by just because they're so tapped into their feelings. to get so mad. Um. You know, so they, so when Cal rejects him, he gets, he gets all, he gets all sad and mad about it. And he's got to, and he's got to strike down whenever it doesn't join him. Cause you know, that's what Sith do. But one thing I appreciate in the game is that Cal doesn't, uh, necessarily know. Oh, he's got my XP, the jerk. Uh, doesn't necessarily know what a Sith is. Um, it's actually never mentioned in the game. No time for you guys. Um, you're right. Yes, I do. Um, so it's very interesting how they never actually say he's a Sith. Uh, they never put a label to it, which I, it definitely makes it very interesting. Um, it's quite possible that Cal never learned what a Sith was as a kid, and Marin wouldn't know either. Uh, Sarah probably does know, but still, you know. All right, Malikos, bring it on. <laughs> Come on! Alright. Oh, I gotta use my double strike thingy. Dang it. My mind is shot. That was nothing. Oh, come on, Cal.
Buddy, help. All right, let's go. There we go. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Oh, see, I hate it. He does that little faint. You're wretched. The only coward run. Wow. Feedy. Oh, whoa, whoa, hey now. I have focused. You. I'm. Ch Whoa! That's the thing. You cannot trade blows with this guy. Dodging won't save. I hardly felt that. Are oh, you? Oh, come on. I totally dodged that. Over here. What, what, what is that? What? Oh, oh, okay, okay. That is some nonsense. I I Whoa, okay. Whoa now. Oh, every time with that. Oh, okay, okay. That's only take two. That's okay. It's all right. Made a few mistakes here. Yeah, it's very hard to talk uh, at this point, uh, simply because he I, he cheats. I will say, I strike him with the blade. He strikes me with the blade, but he does way more damage. That's all right. It's okay. We'll get him. We'll get him. Don't you worry. Though I will say, Marin missed a few times. That did not help. Marin, girl, appreciate it, but you gotta hit the target. All right. Let's try this again. Stop. Come here. Shakes it here. I mean, is it shaking so much as it is just? Anticipation? I don't know where I was going with that. But we got alright, Malikos. It's on. Bring it on. I don't know how to get around that stupid uh rock throw attack. Push doesn't seem to affect him. Maybe I can slow him? I also gotta try using some more of my abilities. Alright. Alright, let's do this. Jedi. Dodging won't save. Oh, come on. Well, he, yeah, whoa, whoa, hey, now. <laughs> Blocking won't help. Try that again. I will. And I'll heal now. Too slow. Oh, what? Come on. That was cheap. I 100% dodged that. The only coward run. Good for nothing, Jedi. You just chill for a minute, will ya? Ah. 
What? Come on! Okay, alright. Then we'll heal while he's down. Ah, uh, you and your stupid little... I swear, I'm hitting the button. Okay, wow. Right here, bud. Yeah, we gotta take two. We're gonna do it. That was nothing. I mean, I'll take it. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, I'm out of force. That's why I can't do that. Alright, we're halfway through. I'm actually a little over. Yeah, get him, Marin. Whoa. Oh, okay. Get out of here, Cal. BD. Need an assist. Uh, BD. All right, that's just bad timing on my part. I need help, bud. Whoa. You like finesse. What? I swear. All right, get him. Why you are so cheap? There we go. Mm. Oh, all right. Okay. Oh, come here. You will not beat me. You shall not hit me. Oh, whoa. Another step. Oh, do not mess this up, dude. Here we go. Okay, I thought I had him. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, did you? Okay, great. I'll take it. I will take it. Like you said, Malikosi, Dothamir will be your grave. Let him lie in the dark with his secrets until death takes him. Why'd you help me? To rid Dothamir of that parasite. All right, I got a little sloppy. But you know what? I'll take it. I did a good job. We beat him. Also, that that was slightly terrifying what Marin did to him. Buried in rock. Ooh. Uh all right, let's see here. Force evasion. That's the howling pole. I think I am gonna go for this, because these kind of work in tandem with each other. That's good for area, though. Ooh. I think I'm going to take this, though, because it gets me more force if I dodge correctly. Cool. All right. So this boss fight stood out a lot more for me because uh, this character loved to faint, and his fighting style really threw me off um so with the double bladed lightsaber you, one of the things that stood out to me when i play this is um i couldn't really talk about while the fight was going on but because he wields lightsabers in both hands he did this kind of like thrusting action toward me and sometimes he would do force push with it 
and sometimes he wouldn't. So that makes you get your guard up or keep it down either way. It's about just getting you to faint and to open up. Uh, he also changed his timing a lot faster than the other bosses. So it was a lot slower before, then it sped up. Uh, some, sometimes when he twirled, you couldn't block it. Sometimes you could. It was all about just paying attention. What are you really doing here, Cal Kestis? The ones who built this tomb, the Zepho, they created an object called the Astrium. It opens a vault on a distant planet. Inside is a list of four sensitive children across the galaxy. But the Empire is looking for it too. What Empire? The Empire. The one bent on exterminating Force sensitives so no one can stand against it? Then it will come for Dothamir before long, as the war did. I will help you find this Astrium. This is also super cool because normally Jedi don't work with Night Sisters. Alright. Thank you, Marin. Thank you for helping me with Malakos. Thought I was a goner for a minute. Yes, you would have died. <laughs> right. I am glad you didn't. It is nice to have an ally. Yeah, I like the sound of that. You're welcome, Cal. New territory for both of them. This place, it's horrifying. Yeah, even Marin lives here and she's like, no, 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 thank you. Oh boy. You know, generally, if you ever see stuff on the wall that where you have a bunch of bodies falling off and someone sitting at the top, generally not a good sign. Just saying. Oh, what mumbo jumbo are we? What's going on? Uh huh. Uh huh. We finally found it. Yeah. It is real. Baron, this could be the key to the next generation of Jedi. I'm happy for you and your Jedi. But nothing can bring back my people. I guess that's one of the things that's interesting about the... Oh, hold on. I was alone for a, a long time. In hiding. I was... I was scared that they'd find out who I was, or what I was. What changed? A very good friend of mine told me to go out and find my place in the galaxy. And you listen? Well, no. Life has this funny way of forcing you on the path forward anyway. Now here I am. Or at least expected. A path forward. I will join you. You will? I've spent years waiting for a chance to avenge my sisters. I'm finished waiting. I wish to fight by your side. Night Sisters and Jedi do not travel together, but survivors. We adapt. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we do. What do you think, BD? My crew, they might take a little bit of convincing, though. Then we'll convince them. I really like Marin as a character because she brings a different, like, element to the group. Just in how she approaches things, how she talks, like, her thought process. She's a really interesting character, and it's a shame she came in so late in the story because we don't get to see her that much. So, uh, EA. If you so happen to stumble upon this set of videos, and this one, oh, great, we got stuff to worry about, we'll get to that. But, 
If you should happen to stumble upon the set of videos and are perhaps listening on the very, very vague chance, I would like a sequel. Just a humble, humble little uh, request. Uh, let's see more Marin. Uh, you just chilling out over there while I gotta make these jumps? All right. And particularly, I'm, I'm more interested in seeing like how uh, Marin adapts to her surroundings, like because we we've seen a lot of like what Cal's gonna do, and we kind of have an idea of what he's gonna do as a Jedi, but having a Night Sister in 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 the in the involved is definitely interesting. There's no way forward. Did you raise the ones before, too? I did. I wanted to see how you would handle Malikos. You were testing me? And you passed. Congratulations. Oh, it's nice you get to dodge all the stuff. You got a ramp that goes up there, by the way? That'd be nice. One thing that I like about this game is that, and I know we've talked about the leveling before, but you can see in the skill tree that, uh, you could, you could see in the skill tree, um, we talked about how, like, figuring out, like, how much XP to award stuff, and I, I didn't really have an answer how that was, but the other thing you have to appreciate is, like, if we look at the skill tree right now, I'm only four points away from getting everything in the skill tree. Granted, I can't really upgrade or like specialize in anything like in like other rpgs but it's been very carefully balanced out that you really don't have to do a lot of grinding um and the abilities do make a difference but not so much so that if you don't have them you can't get through the game Are you gonna help me with this i'm sure you can handle it whoa, whoa, whoa oh both of them that's not cool Whoa, hey now. Whoa, oh wait, hey, whoa. Okay, all right. This is, I can't let them get between me. Or me in between them, rather. Oh, hi. We dancing? That's no fair. That was cool. Ah, oh, you. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, that was a little, a little gucci, but that's okay. You know what? Oh, all right, okay. Oh, you and your death throw. All right, there we go. Cool. All right. Now that we got that out of the way, I mean, I had to use two stems on that, but not bad this overall. Who is she? Steer? Wait, how do you know about her? I have seen your companions. Marikos wanted me to attack them, but they posed no threat. Seer, um... Well, she used to be a Jedi. It's a long story. I would like to learn it. I like how curious she is, too. Again, it's just a shame we don't get to see more of her, but I understand, you know, why. Oh, hello. Is that a thing? I'm going to take a little detour. I'll meet you at your ship. 
Sounds good. You gotta teach me how to do the teleportation, but I suspect that's because she's on Dathomir. That's the thing, like, I was talking about before, where the Night Sisters seem to be a little bit more shamanistic in their use of the Force, rather than, like, through, like, understanding and attunement to it. Um, they sort of, like, dive into the more primal nature of it, at least from what I understand. Uh, and, of course, they can weave way more powerful magics on their home planet, because they, like... The whole planet is like this place of just primal uh, force, I guess you could say. I mean, everything here has evolved to just kill you three ways from Sunday. Or is it five ways from Sunday? I forget I forget what the, uh, the saying is. But, you get the idea. So yes, uh, sequel please, E3. Pretty please. Also, get to work on Dead Space 4. Please? We gotta know how that ends. You left us on a really big cliffhanger, by the way. Oh, can I not? Why can I not do the thing? Whoa. Oh, that's not a... Okay. Aw, oh, man. How do I... Hmm. Is there a fast way down? I, mean, I could go down here. Climb up. Alright, let's try that out, I suppose. I'm just curious to see what's down there, because it could be the last stim. It probably isn't. But you never know, and I'm just going to take a quick look. I mean, what could go wrong? Realistically. Just got to make sure I fall in the right place here. Okay, here we go. Whee! Still terrifying as it was the first time. Only this time we're electing to actually go down. Oh, well... Yep. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Whoa, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Him, please. I mean, at least I can heal on the on the on the jump. You know, if I die on this thing right after I beat a very tough boss, I'm not going to be too happy. <laughs> All right, here we go. Up we go. Oh, yes, with the new climby things, too. Perfect. So I know there's going to be something just waiting around the corner to bite me in the tuckus. I can feel it in my bones. All right, where are we going here? Um, so we're going to go... Can I go that way and then up and then... So can I... Is that a thing that allows me to do that? I will try it. Oh, I did have another thought. Oh, hi. And there's a lot of you. Just not huge fans at all. Would you just get out of here? Oh, you guys are so annoying. Ay, 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 with the bugs and the things. Just shoo away with you. I just want to get a secret. That's all I want. Is that so bad? Uh, okay, so we're going over there. We should be able to climb up. Should be there in a second. And then I should be able to hit you an elevator ride. Easy breezy cover girl. 
Is that still a thing, by the way? Is CoverGirl still around? I don't know. I just remember the ridiculous commercials. Which, you gotta say, that is good PR if for some reason... Oh, hi -ya! Uh, what was I saying? I was talking about Cover Girl for some reason. Um, yeah. So I got you. Gotta admit, if your your commercials must have been pretty good, if you for some reason managed to imprint them in the mind of a fourteen year old kid. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to do. Again, also not what I wanted to do. Oh. Nope. Uh. Buddy. There's anything I can do to make this easier. I mean, for the, for crying out loud. Do you really not want me to get the secrets that badly? Oh, you're right there, huh? Oh, come on. Uh, I'm getting sloppy. All right, where does one go? Up here? Yes, now over here. Oh, right, I can climb the lichen thingies. Is that what it was pointing to? Yes, I think it was. We're going to ignore the Knight Brothers over there. They can just hang out. Oh, was it just to this shortcut? Was that it? Aw, oh, man, that's not... Ugh. I mean, sure, it's a shortcut. I'm glad I unlocked it, question mark. That was totally worth it. Not at all. All right, on we go. Hey, Marin, could you uh, do something about the... Oh, there's two of you? Oh, jeez. Hey, come on. I dodged it. Seriously, man, do something about your uh, your dead sisters. That would be nice. Like, could you just do, like, a little bit of the magic mumbo-jumbo just to, you know, make him go away? That would be nice. All right. Okay, no spiders over here. Oh, great. More of you. Uh, why? Whoa, boy. Come here. Alright, that was pretty flawless, I have to say. Oh, hi.
flawless victory. Bum, bum, bum. Well, I think we can say goodbye to Dathomir. Oh, okay, that was a little iffy there. You found it. Oh, well, who's this? What's that supposed to mean? It means I'll be joining you. Seer, Grease, this is Marin. She's a witch, isn't she? A night sister. Your fear is unnecessary. I couldn't have gotten the Astrium without her. We fought Malakos together. I trust her. And we trust you. You will have to earn it. Okay, fine. <laughs> Grease. Why don't you try anything funny? Welcome aboard. They like you. <laughs> She's like, uh. <laughs> like, I don't know about that, Carl. I don't know what you're saying. All right, let's see. We could head back to Bagano. Might be more to discover there with your improved skills. Uh, isn't that where we have to go anyway, Sarah? Oh, uh, oh, there's 14, two secrets there. One secret here. Uh, let's take a look, quick look at the map, because if I don't see, like, an uh, unexplored area, then I'm very tempted just to say, no, thank you. I mean, if I got all but one stim, right, I'm pretty happy with that. Oh, geez, this area is a lot bigger than I remember. Eh, I don't know. I don't. I, 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 I. I mean, it's 95% explored for crying out loud. Wait, there's a secret somewhere. Oh, it's somewhere in the base. Oh, it's always twisty and windy dindy. Oh. Oh, that's right. I couldn't find it last time either for whatever reason. Hmm. I mean, I could, but I don't think that's going to be very exciting to watch particularly. So I'm just going to say, nah, let's go to Bagano. In fact, uh, we're just about out of time. So I'm actually going to stop the recording here. I will see you on Bagano.